Hello everyone, I am Piyush Vairade. I hope your uh, phase 1 exam went well. So, we are going to do an exam analysis today in this particular video. Okay, what's the difficulty level of the phase 1, both paper 1 and paper 2, we are going to discuss. So, first let's start with general awareness topic. Okay, so general awareness, if you look at there was 20 questions, right? So, they focus more on the November and December month current affairs. November and December month current affairs. There was few questions based on the static knowledge about the CB. Static knowledge we can say about the CB, right? So, there was one question based on the DRHP, right? And few questions based on the Bombay Stock Exchange and NSC, right? So, you can see few general uh, knowledge regarding the CB, right? So, there was two to three questions based on that. November to December current affair was there and then few questions based on the static uh, data here, okay? So, there was one question, who is the badminton player? So, PV Sindhu was the answer, right? So, simple this type of question was there. So, I can say this general awareness part is on the easier side. Easy to moderate, we can say. If you have just gone through the last two month current affairs, you can easily attempt 10 to 12 questions here. So, 10 to 12 questions was on the easier side, right? This is what we can say. Again, there was one question based on the UA AI mission, right? That was launched by India, that was launched under India AI mission. That was the answer, right? So, you can say this type of question was there. And I can say 10 to 12 questions was easily solvable from these 20 questions here. If you have just gone to the last two month current affairs, that's it, okay? So, this regarding the general awareness part. The second one is basically English. So, GA was easy to moderate. English, I can say on the easier side, okay? Within 10 minutes or within less than 10 minutes, you can solve all the 20 questions here, right? English was on the easier side. One passage was given to you, right? And based on that, there was few questions. Simple passage was there, right? So, if you observe our mock test, like what I have provided, two free mock tests. In my paid course also, there was three mock tests, right? So, we can say English was on the similar side only, right? So, passage was there. There were few questions based on the this sentence was given to us. We need to find out the correct order. Right, para jumble type of question was there. Right, then fill in the blanks type of question was there. So, I can say English is on the easier side basically, right. So, one can easily attend 15 to 16 question out of 20 here, okay, in less than 10 minutes. It was that easy, okay. So, what you need to do for that, okay. So, just have a reading habit here. Read, you can read the newspaper or any book that is good enough for this particular English section here. Okay, so you have to read continuously newspaper or books, we can say. So, that is basically enough for English part. It was on the easier side. So, 15 to 16, one can easily attempt. Next, we have aptitude part here. Aptitude part. So, aptitude part, I can say easy to moderate. Easy to moderate. Why? There was one question based on the line chart here, right? Like line graph was given to you and there was five question or four question based on that. That question was on the difficult side. Okay, that question was on difficult side. Just all the question was on the easier side, we can say. So, I can say again here 10 to 12 question was on the easy to side, easy, easy side, right? So, we can easily attempt 10 to 12 questions from aptitude part here. Okay, so there was four question based on the simplification here. Simplification, so 24.99 into 14.99 uh, like that, divide by like that. So, those type of question was there. Simple one, right? Then there were few questions based on the profit and loss, I guess, right? Profit and loss, simple question was there, right? There was four questions based on finding out the wrong number in the series, out of which two were easy, two were difficult. So, I can say in overall, 10 to 12 questions, you can easily attain from aptitude part here, okay? So, easy to moderate, we can say aptitude part, okay? Now, you can just comment below what you feel about the GA, English and aptitude part here or overall paper 1 and paper 2. Okay, so if you remember few questions from the exam, you can also comment below. We'll try to find out the answer for that. Then we have reasoning part here. Now, here you can see reasoning. In reasoning, I guess three puzzles was there. And this reasoning was on the moderate to difficult side, we can say. Moderate to difficult side, right? So, one puzzle was on the easier side of boxes. So, there was a puzzle was given to us. So, only one box is kept between red and A box. So that boxes puzzle was on the easier side. Second puzzle was there when the three months were given, right? 
July, August, September, then 9 and 16 date was there and there were 5, 6 subjects, right? So that puzzle was on the difficult side. But if you have practiced it enough, if you have practicing this reasoning puzzle regularly from last two months, then you can easily attempt those particular puzzles also, right? So if someone is preparing for banking exam regularly, for them reasoning was also on the easier side. But for the people who are just preparing for SEBI or RBI kind of exam, IT officer exam, for them this reasoning will be on the moderate difficult side here. Okay, so there was one more question that was on the difficult or moderate to difficult we can say. So overall it's moderate to difficult and I can say good attempt is basically 6 to 8 from this particular reasoning topic. Okay, I am not considering the people who are regularly giving the banking exam. Okay, for them reasoning was also on the easier side. Okay, but for other people you can see 6 to 8 was the good attempt here. Now if you look at overall paper 1 part. Out of 80 questions, I can say 50 questions was on the easier side. We can easily attempt in 60 minutes. Okay. So, 45 to 60 questions. So, 45 to 50 is basically on the easier side. We can easily do in the 60 minute. Okay. So, this is regarding the paper one. Please comment your opinion below. Okay. What do you feel about the paper one? About GA, about English, about aptitude part, about reasoning part. And if you have attempted our mock test, free mock test or even paid mock test, you can see English was on the similar side. Even aptitude was also similar side, but only this uh, particular question was on the difficult side in our actual paper. In the mock test, this was on the easier side, Okay, we can say. Okay, so I can say English and aptitude part was on the similar side, what we have conducted in the mock test. GA, no one can predict. I have this focus on the current affairs. So, what are the questions you can see based on the November and December that I already covered in the mock test. So, I have just focused on the current affairs. That's it. So, reasoning I can say moderate to difficult here. Okay. But 45 to 50 is the good attempt for this particular paper one. Okay. In 60 minutes. So, this is regarding the paper one. Now, important paper two. Paper two here. Now, if you observe paper two, right. So, this was also on the easier side. Simple, simple question was there. One liner question was there, right? If you look at the database concept, there was one question based on the 2NF, right? If you look at, uh, there was one question based on the transaction, transaction concurrency concept, right? Then there was one question based on a uh, what? B tree, right? So order is given to us. We need to find out number of children it can have. So M minus one was the correct answer there. Then B plus 3 time complexity question was there, right? So I already asked this type of question in our mock test. You can see. So time complexity for B plus 3 is basically order of log n, right? So that was the correct option. So there are a few questions directly from the test series. And almost out of 50 questions, you can see 45 questions you can easily solve if you have gone through my notes and test series. That's it. Notes plus test series, if you have gone through, you can easily solve 45 questions. And time was good enough. 40 minutes is more than enough to solve that 50 questions, I can say. Even if you have not gone through the lectures, but if you have just gone through notes and test series, so this was on the easier side. 45 questions directly from the notes and the test series, we can say, out of 50. So, B3, B plus 3. In SQL, you can see there was one question based on the inner join. Simple how inner join works, right? So, there was one question based on the second highest salary. We need to order by descending order and then put the row number equals to 2. That type of question was there in SQL. There was few question based on the aggregate function. Count star was the correct uh, answer there. If you look at same question I have asked in my mock test as well. Right, based on the aggregate function. Then there was one question based on the aggregate function but not null. Department is not null. Right, is not null. So that was the correct option there. So again, simple question from SQL and database, we can say, if you look at the networking, networking subject, again, all the five questions you can solve based on the notes here, right? All the five questions directly from the networking notes. So simple question, DNS, right, belong to application layer protocol, that type of question was there, right? And there were a few other questions, but all the questions you can solve based on my notes. Then cyber security. Cyber security. One question was there directly from the test series itself. Unauthorized access, right? That is basically uh, what we can say. Confidentiality, right? So based on the CIA trial, right? Based on the CIA, there was one question. Then 
attack, cyber attack. We have discussed many questions based on the cyber attack. If you look at the subject wise test, right? So cyber security also, you can easily solve all the questions based on my notes I have provided. Except one question, out of five questions, four questions can be easily solved from the notes itself. Okay. So this is, you can see DBMS, SQL, networking, cyber security. Then there were a few questions based on the Python. Simple Python extend function was not extend. Append function was given, right? We need to find out the number of elements in that list. Append function, right? So append, we are going to append the list there, but that will be considered as an element, right? So that question was there. Then again, slicing. Also, one question was based on the slicing, right? Step was optional. That was the correct answer there. Very, very easy question. If you have uh, watch my YouTube videos also based on the SQL or database concept or a Python list, right? So if you have just watched my YouTube videos also, what are the videos I have uploaded for CB exam? You can easily solve 10 to 12 question there, right? You can easily solve 10 to 12 question based on the YouTube videos only. But if you have gone through my notes and test series, 45 question you can easily solve. Simple, simple question was there, right? So one question was based on the RE module what we have discussed in the regress, right? So sub wall was the correct answer there. We don't have this kind of function in regex, right? So simple question was there. So I can say entire paper 2 was on the easier side. Entire paper 2 was on the easier side and I can say 35 to 40 questions is basically a good attempt here. Right? One can easily solve 35 to 40 questions and if you have gone through my notes and test series, you can easily attempt 40 to 45 questions as well. Okay. An important part, there were a few questions based on the C++ output of the code, right? C code was there and then OOPS concept was based on the C++ only, right? There were a few questions based on the Java also. So that was also on the easier side if you have understand that. And But if you observe OOPS concept, they have asked based on the C++ language here. And there was one question, not one question, two questions based on the scope of the variable. Scope of the variable. Just go to my YouTube channel. I have uploaded one video based on the scope of the variable. In that, I have discussed the concept and have provided the notes to you. So, if you have gone through my notes and that particular video, you can easily solve both the question based on the scope of the variable. You can check out that video as well, right? So, you can see overall paper 2 was on the easier side. So, 40 question was on the easier side, we can say. So, I hope you are able to solve all this question, right? Now, the thing is how to prepare for the phase 2 examination here because you can see 80 marks is the cutoff for the clearing phase 1. 30% in paper 1, 40% in paper 2, overall 80 marks you should get, right? So, how to prepare for the phase 2 exam? I am going to come up with that video also, next video. And if you like this particular exam analysis, do hit a like button as well, right? So, let me tell you about the phase 2 course here. So, we will go to my website. So, you can see uh, my website fuchwire.com. I am providing entire phase 1 and phase 2 uh, course for IT officer, right? So, we already completed phase 1 here. So, you can see the content I have provided, right? You can see a topic wise footage for paper 2. I already added in the course here, right? So, you can see these are the phase 1 videos, and you can see almost all the questions can be easily solved based on this particular videos and the notes. But now, what about the phase 2? You can see. So, I already started uploading the videos for the phase 2. You can see string manipulation videos, phase 2, right? I uploaded 4 videos as of now and I already recorded one more video. So, we are going to upload that as well. So, you can see we are going to cover entire phase 2 syllabus here. We are going to cover entire phase 2 syllabus, lectures, plus notes, plus test series for phase 2. And if possible, we are going to take the live classes as well just one week before the exam, okay? So, we are going to cover almost all the syllabus here. If you observe, everything is already covered in my gate DA course. Only this is not covered in algorithm part. So, we are going to uh, cover that as well. In data structures, you can see everything is covered. Only matrix is not covered specifically. So, I am going to record a video. Also, JSON object is not covered in gate DA course. I am going to cover that. But almost all the topics are already covered in the gate DA course. And I am going to record the videos for the string manipulation. And oops concept here. You can see the videos based on the algorithms and data structures here, right? So I have already uploaded all the videos. You can simply go through that. And you can see the weightage also 30 and 40. 
70 percent weightage is given to algorithm and data structure here right so we are going to focus more on this particular topics right so please go to the content and i am going to provide the test series for this as well so we are going to start test series from 13th of january but first you need to go to the content here right you can you can also download the notes from this particular section here so i'm going to come up with a detailed video regarding the phase two right so that's it from my side thank you